Hi there, I'm Alex Kerr from Blackhawk Global, coming to you with today's daily market update. Uh, overnight, we had the HSBC Chinese Manufacturing PMI, uh, which lifted to 50.4, and this was positive for China and the Australian dollar. However, the Australian dollar saw very little movement and is currently stuck in a consolidation pattern, and any positive Chinese data may not have a good effect for the Australian dollar in the future. Uh, moving across to Europe, which was the big one overnight, uh, German manufacturing PMI lifted to 51.8, but this looks likely on the back of a weaker euro, and a lot of manufacturers are pricing this in as a result. However, French manufacturing and services PMI all weakened, but overall European PMI data all lifted across the board. And thirdly, uh, UK retail sales were much weaker than expected at negative 0.3%. And this shows us that the UK economy is having a bit of a struggle at the moment. However, this might just be seasonal, uh, so we may see some improvement in the economy in the long run. And looking at the US, unemployment claims were up to 283k. However, this is still a very strong result overall, and people shouldn't take it in a negative view. And the market so far has been relatively positive, about anything under 300k, and this looks like an improving labour market. So we should still see improvements in the S&P 500 and various other US indexes. And also looking at oil markets, uh, they lifted briefly overnight up to $82 as Saudi Arabia cut supply. And this just might be to sustain price levels at the moment as the Saudis will be a little bit concerned about any further price falls. However, markets have been somewhat bullish about this move and they may still remain bullish for some time until we see further weakening of demand in oil. And finally, looking at the New Zealand trade balance, and that fell sharply to $1.35 billion. And this is on the back of much stronger imports and a weakening New Zealand dollar. However, we do have a seasonal trade balance, and it does generally fall. Overall, though, that's all we have time for today. Thanks for listening. I'm Alex Gurr.